Hey, what's up guys? I don't know if a lot of you are like me, but I've always wondered what the inside of a good exhaust system looks like. So I'm going to show you guys today. You see right here, I have the, uh, oops, try to get a better angle, maybe not. Uh, that's about as good as I'm going to get. I have the ARC exhaust, maybe through here, that would be better. Um, on the NSX and it's one of the better sounding exhausts I've always kind of wondered how the baffling was like inside and uh, I figured I dug out one of my kind of endoscopic probe type cameras which is you know USB into what you can see there on the screen Right, you know, that's there are my tools. So, anyway, I stuck it in there and I'll show you guys what that was like. So, here we go, we're entering the JDM exhaust abyss with my endoscopic camera uh, this is the start of the perforated steel section you can see that nice rainbowing color of the ARC titanium so this thing pretty much I could confirm is legit it's titanium inside even the perforated steel is also made out of titanium which is good to know it's an expensive exhaust you can see right there there's a strand of fiberglass fill so most likely what's surrounding this pipe is uh, fiberglass uh, polyfill or fiberglass um, strands to help uh, tone down and, and tune the sound so I'm nearing I think at this point I'm nearing the end it was a little tricky pushing this camera through it kept on getting caught and snagged and you can see I wasn't able to really center it. it's almost impossible after it curves but towards the end of this is uh, uh, here's where I actually run out of length and here's another evidence of, of some additional fiberglass. Um, this is about the farthest I got but uh, as I pull back here you know when when folks are designing exhaust there's a bunch of different factors they need to consider uh, obviously the flow and the scavenging effects that they can possibly accomplish um, the weight they've got to keep it down but yet still manage, uh, you know, um, try to attenuate the drone because nobody likes a drone. And also, lastly, they also need to manage the sound. So there's a lot of science involved. I actually put a, prime, uh, a thread on NSX Prime. Um, I think you can search under F1 sounding exhaust or something like that. And uh, Dave McCreary and I went through a lot of effort um, getting sound recording devices and measuring the actual sound. Uh, coming out of the NSX trying to make you know the holy grail f1 style exhaust which I don't think any company's really accomplished just because of the firing order and the compression ratio and the size of the tubing and the way the v6 layout is it's it's really difficult to do that in the NSX so now I'm basically almost almost out of it completely and uh, that's unfortunately that's kind of all I saw I'll try to do a better job next time because I do think there's something on the other side. So as you saw in the video, I got basically the camera and this uh, makeshift um, clothes hanger through there. It was surprisingly more difficult than I expected. I thought it'd be pretty easy to stick something in there and just fish it through. But as you can see, the length, I had basically this whole uh, piece of, of uh, clothes hanger, straightened out clothes hanger in the exhaust. So I had it all the way up to here. So you can imagine as the length of that piece basically almost spans the whole entire length of the exhaust. So I went all the way to the other side. So guys, you've now seen the inside of a uh, ARC NSX titanium exhaust probably not much of a surprise for many of you but I was hoping to see more baffling 
and more of the individual chambers. But, you know, I have a feeling that a lot of it is hidden within the canister and all we saw was the perforated chamber that is uh, has a fiberglass fill. Oh, check out all this ash. <sighs> we just had a recent fire. We just had two weeks of intense fire here where I live. So just a shout out to the firefighters and the, uh, and the rescue workers, uh, first responders. You guys are really awesome. Thank you so much.